How you doing, gang? My name is Ryan Mackey, Vice President of Training Operations here at Performance QSA. I just want to welcome you to our Winter Speed and Strength Camp. It's going to be an awesome time for the athletes to be able to improve themselves during the break while they're not just sitting at home watching TV. Uh, what we want to do today is just, just in case you missed the in-house orientation Monday night at 7 p.m., we want to go over some of the details. And even if you do come, you can still have this video to reference. We want to talk a little bit about the particulars of the camp. It's going to start today, December 2nd, and if you are coming in today, you can come to the 4.30 training session, December 2nd, without having come to the 7 p.m. orientation. So we'll kick off today, December 2nd, we will go all the way through December 20th. That is right around the Christmas times where we close down for the holidays and do a lot of uh, end of the year meetings and things of the sort. We'll pick back up on January 1st and go all the way through the month of January to the 31st, okay? So you've got seven full weeks to get in 21 training sessions. So what does that mean? Well, that means that you can come five days in a row and then you can knock out all your training sessions in the first three weeks if you want to. That's totally up to you. Or you can allocate them and spread them out over the course of the seven weeks. The plan is for you to train consistently with a smart, methodic approach, methodical approach. So we suggest that you take them every other day of the week, but your schedule may not allow you to do that. School, travel for the holidays, what have you, you may have to mix it up. So you might need to come three days one week, four days the next, whatever you want to do. But you've got seven weeks to get in your 21 sessions. They do not carry over after the 31st. So if you use them or you lose them kind of concept, okay? So for our age groups, 10 years old to eighth grade, all right, we're going Monday through Friday at 4.30 p.m. to 5.30 p.m. Okay, we've got that hour set aside for our younger athletes. And there's a reason we have the athletes separated from the high school and the college athletes. The training program is that of a speed and a strength camp. Okay, so with some of our older athletes, we're going to be focusing on the speed perspective from the strength aspect. Okay, so they're going to develop that speed from adding resistance to the body. Our younger athletes may not be physically mature enough for that just yet, so we want to make sure they're getting a good program that's focused around fun, but also allowing them to still get the benefits of speed and strength, but at their own capacity. So our younger athletes will not be able to move up into the higher age groups, but then our older athletes can come down. Now they'll miss some of the dynamic from that program, but they still have the option to come down if they want to. Ninth and 10th and 12th graders, ninth through 12th grade, are high school athletes. We've got speed training for you guys at 6.15 a.m. Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, okay? 6.15 a.m. Monday, Wednesday, and Friday for speed development. Then you have the option to come in the afternoon at 5.30 p.m. or 6.30 p.m. and do our strength development classes, okay? You can come in, get in those training sessions with our Beast Fit Strength classes and improve yourself from that regard as well. So theoretically, our high school athletes, you could come at 6.15 a.m., do a speed session, take all day in the classroom to recover, or if you're not in school that day, kind of go home, relax a little bit, come back in the evening, roughly six hours later, and get in a good strength session. So almost pull a two a day if you want to, okay? Then, for our college athletes, if we have any college athletes come back for the, uh, the winter break, depending on how many we have, we'll dictate their schedule based on what they're able to do. So with those kids being not being in school and being having the ability to drive and get themselves here, we will adjust our schedule for them based on what they can do. So that's why we don't have a set time for them just yet, because we may have one, we may have 15, but we'll figure that out as we go along. So just to give you a quick overview, December 2nd through the 20th, we'll pick back up on January 1st and go all the way through the 31st. You've got seven weeks to get in 21 sessions, okay? Seven weeks to get in 21 sessions. 10 years old, eighth grade, we're going Monday through Friday from 4.30 to 5.30 p.m. It's five days a week, okay? High schoolers, 9th to, to 12th grade, we're going speed development Monday, Wednesday, Friday at 6.15 a.m. with strength training 5.30 and 6.30 p.m. College athletes, that will be determined. Okay, so if you have any questions about anything, if you get this video today, still come to the orientation. If you have more questions, you'd like those answered in person, you can reach out to DJ Johnson, who is our director of our competitive athlete performance institute, who will be handling all details and uh, the programming for the training. Uh, so if you have any questions, you can direct that to him, or you can reach out to myself here at Performance QSA. We hope you guys have a great winter break, and we look forward to uh, seeing you tonight.